Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Trump predicts Democrats will be beaten badly in midterms, reveals battle plan. President Donald Trump is prepared to go to war with the Democrats as he said he is ready for a vicious fight and then cautioned Democrats that they are going to get beaten so badly in the midterm elections in 2018. The president sat with Fox News Maria Bartiromo and discussed the battle plan. Prior to getting onto the topic of the Democrats and how the party has shifted so far to the left that it is bordering on communism, the president spoke to Bartiromo about his historic summit with North Korean chairman Kim Jong-un in Singapore last month. He said that the North Koreans should be telling the United States exactly where their facilities are and he would be talking to Kim to find out how serious he is about denuclearization. I think they're very serious about it, he said. We had a very good chemistry, he added. Bartiromo asked the president if he believed Kim was sincere. I made a deal with him, I shook hands with him. I really believe he means it. Now, is it possible, have I been in deals, have you been in things where people didn't work out? It's possible, he said. The president went on to attack Democrats on a myriad of issues, including the new mantra that many mainstream Democrats have begun to support abolishing immigration and customs enforcement. I hope they keep thinking about it because they're going to get beaten so badly, he said. These are the guys that go in and take MS-13 and they take them out because they are much tougher than MS-13 like by a factor of 10. You get rid of ICE, you're going to have a country that you're going to be afraid to walk out of your house. I love that issue if they're actually going to do that, he added. That's going to be their platform, the president said. Open borders, which equals crime. I think they will never win another election. In the past several weeks, many top Democrats have called for an end to ICE, which was created after the terrorist attacks of 9-11. Senator Kirsten Gillibrand told CNN, in an interview on Thursday, that she wants to abolish the agency. I believe that, immigration and customs enforcement, has become a deportation force, and that's why I believe you should get rid of it. Start over, reimagine it and build something that actually works, she said. Someone should tell the senator that it does work. It has deported numerous criminal illegal aliens and MS-13 members. It does not work if what you want to do is keep future Democrat voters in the United States. Senator Gillibrand was joined in her calls to abolish ICE by New York City Mayor Bill de Blasio, Senator Kamala Harris, and Rep. Mark Pockin, who said he is going to introduce legislation to get rid of the agency. The president also addressed the coming fight with Democrats over his appointment of a Supreme Court justice now that Justice Anthony Kennedy, a conservative, considered to be a moderate, announced his retirement. I think we are going to have support from Democrats, frankly. I think, if it's the right person, I'm going to pick the right person, I'm going to pick somebody that's outstanding. And, everybody on that list is outstanding, but I'm going to pick somebody who is outstanding. It's probably going to be vicious because the other side, all they can do is obstruct and resist. You know the whole thing is resist. But, and maybe someday we'll be able to get along with the other side. I don't know. But, right now, it's only resist. That's all they want to do is stop things from happening. So they're going to try very hard, but I think it's going to go actually very quickly if I pick the right person, he said. The president knows he has the strong hand in this poker game. The Democrats have no power no ability to abolish ICE or to stop the president's Supreme Court pick. The only thing they have is the ability to grandstand, which they have been doing since Donald Trump was elected president. It has not worked thus far, and there is no reason to believe it will this time. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click like and subscribe. Thank you.